Welcome back guys and girls to another PvP build back to my Magic Castle also. But this time with two pets. Let's get started. As once I said, Shudan for Major Resolve. Since we have two pets, our bars are kinda bad. We need an extra slot. That's why I use Shudan. So we don't have to use our resistance buff uh, about the storm. I put Dampen Magic instead. And sometimes I use the Deadwick Minefields. Our 5 set piece bonus is Unleash Ritualist. It gives 15% additional damage um, on pets and a good amount of Magicka too. Our second 5 set piece bonus is Nico Potency. It gives a ton of Max Magicka if we have a pet slotted. On the Jewelry, full spell damage, full arcane. Then 1, 2, 3, 4 Impen and 3 Well Fitted, 5 Light, 1 Medium and 1 Heavy. On the front bar a Inferno Stuff in Nirnhorn with the Flame Damage Enchant. And on the back bar a Restoration Stuff in Defending with the Berserker Glyph. Full Prismatic Glyphs on the body by the way. Quick look on the skills, first pet is the Twilight Matriarch. It deals a good amount of damage, but the healing guys, it's insane. One of the strongest healing out there, honestly. And it heals up to two friendly targets on top of that. Second pet, a Volatile Familiar. Deals also a good amount of damage, and it stuns the enemy with the last tick. Force pulls are spammable. You could go alternative with uh, Elemental Weapon, but I don't have Psychic here. Then Crystal Fragment, Streak, our EU Eastern, and the Greater Storm Atronarch as Ultimate. Alternative, in group play for example, I use Negate, or sometimes Overload, or Shooting Star, depends on the situation. But I prefer the Atronarch to be able to go line of sight, even open field. Back bar, Hardened Ward, first shield, second shield, Damp and Magic. Then two pets again, we have to slot them on both bars. And Dark Conversion for Sustain and Healing. As Defensive Ultimate, Light's Champion. Alternative, you could go with Temple Guard. The Psychic Ultimate just slotted for Minor Protection. Race High Elf is probably the best choice to go, since we gain a Stamina and Magicka region with Spell Recharge. Then Max Magica and Spell Damage. Dunma is fine too, by the way. As Mundustone, the Atronarch for extra sustain. And the Clockwork Citrus Fully as Buffoot. Attribute points 20 points in health and 44 in Magica. Potions, most of the time the Spare Power Potions with Sorcery, Prophecy, and Max Magica. Sometimes in pressured situation, I use the Tricer Potions. Quick look on the CPs, the Deadly Aim, Mastered Arms, Resilience, Dual 3 Buff, Rejuvenation, Shield Master, Bastion, and Juggernaut. Before the gameplay footage starts, don't forget to sub my channel. Over 80% are still sub. Do me the favor, click on this red jersey button and support me, guys. I'm out for now. I wish you all a fantastic day and enjoy the gameplay clips. I see you hopefully in the next video. Ciao.
I was wrong, even once wasn't anything. Yeah, I can say that you didn't need any more from me. Yeah, maybe it's not me, you should be the one on your knees. So if we had another chance, I would never let you steal my Yeah.